Day 43, start of week 7, Red Ranger Broilers, I have 27 of them, 13 in this tractor, and 14 in this tractor. As you can see, they got plenty of room now. big. These are the bigger 13. These are the smaller 14. Doing really well. Love and life. So far it's a wonderful start to week 7. Day 44, Red Ranger Broilers. They're eating right at six trays of food a day. I ended up uh, buying them another feeder, so they both now have two. I took the top off of the red feeder. I'm trying to show the people the feeder. You guys are getting in the way. Say they want to see me anyway. I took the top off of the, this feeder. That way they're actually eating it all the way to the bottom now. I still got some food. It's getting dark though. So I gave them a feeder this morning and then I gave them two feeders this afternoon each. These guys still have some food left too. Yep. They got food in both trays. The 14 smaller ones don't seem to eat as much as the uh, 13 big ones. But, as you can see, the uh, egg layers are having a field day with the mulch that I put down. And the grass has no problem popping up back up through it. Had some rain this morning. But they're cruising right along. They're doing really well. I only fill up their uh, five gallon buckets about halfway. That way they're easier to move in the mornings. Now that they're split up, they don't actually go through a full five gallon bucket a piece anymore. So I'd rather just make sure that it stays about halfway full. Top it off a couple times a day. They're about to start to go over the uh, mulch area. Um, it's been down for about a week, so I'm sure there's some kind of insect activity going on underneath all that. So they should have fun with that. Someday there will be grass and weeds and topsoil in this area. That's the goal, anyway. Day 45, Red Ranger Broilers. They're getting quite large. They're enjoying having separate space. I went ahead and got a fourth feeder. They're eating a little over seven trays of food a day. Going through the water, they seem to be enjoying having more room to move around. They got plenty of room right now to move around for as big as they are. As you can see, there's plenty of room in there. Cruising right along, pretty much on autopilot. You guys know chickens are easy. Make sure that they have what they need and they're happy. Day 46, Red Ranger Broilers. As you can see, they're getting large. 
They're doing really well. Still moving them every morning. Drinking plenty of water. I fill up their water buckets every morning after I move them. They're eating more than seven trays of food a day. Getting close to about four trays of food a piece. Not quite. Really more about seven and a half trays total. Day 47, Red Ranger Broilers. They're eating a little over seven trays of food a day. The love and life, having had, being able to have all this extra free space. I'm really glad that I made them a second tractor. Plenty of room. There's the other ones. How are you guys doing this morning? But they're doing really good. I'm moving them every morning still. Right now they're over the area that I laid down mulch. They're doing really, really well. Can't complain at all. Day 48, Red Ranger Broilers. They're eating more than seven trays of food a day. I'm moving them every morning. another chicken. What are you guys going to do about it? Yeah, you tell them. You tell them. You say, get out of here. Say, get out of here. But they're doing really well. They're getting extremely large. Day 49. End of week seven, Red Ranger Broilers. As you can see, they're at the end of the mulched area. Back here is my blackberry bushes. So this tractor will go this way tomorrow. And this tractor will go this way. So they'll start to get some distance, at least until this tractor has to make two steps to get beyond this one. But that's the pattern I'm going with. They're eating nearly eight trays of food a day. I still dump a little bit of food out after I move them in the morning out of their trays onto the ground so that they can go ahead and clean that up. But as you can see, they got plenty of room still.
I actually heard um, some of them making their first crowing noises this morning. Well, cracking crowing noises. <laughs> Sounds really cute. Sounds like somebody that doesn't know how to play a trombone. You're getting so big. What am I gonna do with you? Oh yeah, that's right. I'm gonna eat you. Get bigger. I want to thank you for watching. Ask that you subscribe. Leave a comment. Leave a thumbs up. Hit that bell. That way you'll be notified when I put out new videos.